Yeah, several nurses are sounding off outside of a Watsonville hospital and now a new deal that could keep them in their jobs. Well, good evening. It's great to be with you here on this Friday. I'm Scott Rates. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Veronica Macias. We start with that breaking news this evening. A deal has been reached. The Watsonville Community Hospital reaching a preliminary agreement now to sell its operations to a new health care district sponsored by the Pajaro Valley Health Care District Project. Now this deal could secure the hospital's future, keeping its doors open, and that would mean, Veronica, that several members of the staff out there could keep their jobs. That's what they're hoping for tonight. The Watsonville Community Hospital will now stay open after reaching the agreement here with a bidder potential potentially. KIO's Jonathan Saravia joining us now with the very latest. The hospital says the sale will only be completed once a bankruptcy court approves the sale to the Pajaro Valley Healthcare District. With this preliminary agreement, the hospital says they have enough funding to continue operations through the end of March 2022. It will only become official through a sale process that could be finalized a month before that. And it may be a sign of relief for the dozens of employees who gathered outside the hospital pleading for the hospital to stay open. But they weren't the only ones who were concerned. Maria Rodriguez Rubio and Abraham go to the hospital once a month and rely on it as others do in the community. It is very important because people need care quickly. What if there's an emergency? This is where we all go to because it's closer. Who's going to care for us? Where are we going to go? It's not fair that they want to close it. There are too many of us who need medical attention and rely on this hospital. In a statement to KION, the CEO of Watsonville Community Hospital, Stephen Salier, says Watsonville Community Community hospitals focus today as it is every day is on providing exceptional quality patient care to our community. We are proud of our nurses, physicians and other staff who continue to serve our patients with the utmost compassion and kindness. The hospital also says this framework allows them to get additional help and financial support to keep the hospital open for the future. Reporting from Watsonville, Jonathan Sarabia, KI News, Channel 546. And while the preliminary agreement has been reached, it's still unknown, however, whether all the nurses at the hospital will be able to keep their jobs under this new potential agreement.